What's going on all you gamers? Today I'm going to be showing you how to get the Patriarch's Prototype Hammer. If that sounds like something that interests you, then stay tuned, it's coming up next. Welcome back all you guys and girls. Yeah, so getting this will take a little bit of time. Your Kodiak will have to be at least level 2 upgraded uh, to get through the radioactive zones and you'll have to be doing the quest the psychopath which is quite a long quest to be perfectly honest but it's good to know just so that you don't miss a few things along the way now if you need to know where aspen is it is as you can see where i am right up the top so just here is where you start at in your ranger base obviously you go down make a left and then continue up to the very top of the map and like I said, I believe it's a level 17 quest called the Psychopath. What you do from there, you go in. Now what I'm going to do is go straight to Little Hell, because that is where we'll actually find the item. But if you haven't done any of this, you'll have to complete all of the Aspen bit, then get into a lift and go to Little Hell. So here you are, and what you want to do is proceed in. Now obviously I've already kind of massacred everyone as you can see from the lovely decorated floor place, uh, decorated in well blood and splatter, but there are a lot of battles, this does take a lot of time, this is kind of after everything's done just to show you what you need to do. So if I remember correctly, just over here there will be a person that you actually have who's nailed to the floor and you want to help him out and try and basically unnail him and then speak to him. He'll tell you to go and save a lot of people. The first person you'll do, you'll be coming out here, going up this way, chucking a right, and just through here, there will be Oh, he's still there. I thought he might have gone. Right, there's another person called Llewellyn who you talk to. Now, he needs medical help. I can't remember exactly what it is, but I think it's number six you need. So you need six in med medic. Um, but even that isn't enough. He basically tells you that he swallowed a key and that's the key to the armory, if I remember correctly. From here, what you'll need to do will be to go down this way. and go through here you'll have a cutscene there'll be a few things you can do you can either fight the people or you can spare them and talk to them I kind of just kept them on the good side it seemed to work out for the best and I got help at the end for it uh, what you will need to do though you'll go over to here and you'll need to create a potion so basically I don't think I could do it at the moment basically I created a laxative now, if I can find the footage of me doing that, because you need to do it in a specific way, uh, then I will chuck it on. If not, I will write it somewhere below. But yeah, once you've got the laxative, I think you might need to pick up a container somewhere in this room as well. I'm not 100% sure. But either way, you just you make the laxative, and then you head straight back down to the person. You'll give that to them in there, and then they'll... Uh, how can I put this? They're going to poop out the key. That's what it basically is. From there, you need to go and find the vault. Now, if I can remember correctly, the vault is up this way. Here we go. So, as you see, that big open door that you will never get through without this key, that's the vault. From there, Inside here is where you find the golden hammer. Now, loot these other things in here as well, obviously, because you'll want to loot everything. This mission is almost definitely, bar none, where you get the most stuff. There are so many lockpicking situations, it's unbelievable. Before you come to here, make sure you have lockpick 9 or 10. There are lots, lots to get. So, basically, you've got the golden hammer, and I'll show you that in my inventory.
There you go, gold plated hammer. And I had no idea what to do with this. But I did have a wander after I'd kind of done everything and saved it. And what you'll notice is just over here, there's kind of a dodgy wall. And it says, use gold plated hammer. Now there's no way to lockpick this, so you have to hit it with the hammer. And once you go inside, if you click on this, lo and behold, you have the Patriarch's Prototype Hammer. It is a really nice blunt weapon and it kind of does the job. It is, it is pretty devastating. I don't know if it's the best one in the game though. I think you can get better um, items than this that are blunt, but I would say for this type of the game, it is really, really good to have. Now, one thing to note, I have been told by someone that there's something else you can use that gold plated hammer for. I haven't found it yet. So if I do, I will update you because I'll go and uh, check this back to a later save as such. But this is definitely how you get that. So if you want that in your, in your life and on one of your characters, then that's the way. Right guys and girls, as always, I hope this has helped some of you out. If you like the com content, then why not drop a like as that really helps the channel. And why not hit that subscribe and bell icon if you'd like to see more content from me on all the latest and greatest Xbox and soon Xbox Series X gameplay. As always, take care. I'll see you on the next day.